Megan Fox's biggest bombshells from loving a narcissist to heartbreaking miscarriage. Welcome to my channel, Royal Family Alt. Actress Megan Fox has released her debut collection of poems in which she alludes to being drained by the men in her life and suffering a devastating miscarriage. Megan Fox has opened up about her personal struggles and intimate relationships in her debut poetry collection, Pretty Boys Are Poisonous. In the book, Megan talks about toxicity in relationships and describes what it's like to be addicted to a partner she describes as a narcissist. The poems take inspiration from the actress's own life as well as her imagination. Speaking about her debut book of poems, Megan said in a statement, I've spent my entire life keeping the secrets of men, my body aches from carrying the weight of their sins. My freedom lives in these pages, and I hope that my words can inspire others to take back their happiness. Here, we've taken a look back at some of the most explosive parts of the book. The last two poems of Megan's book, titled I and Tuiki, allude to the actress suffering a heartbreaking miscarriage just weeks into her pregnancy. In one poem, she wrote, There is an ultrasound by your side of the bed, ten weeks and one day. She questioned whether her baby would have left a suicide note if they had been able. She said she would sometimes close her eyes and imagine holding you tight against my chest. Megan revealed she had been expecting a baby girl. In an emotional plea, the actress asked what it would cost for her to pay the ransom for her soul. Megan doesn't mention any of her romances by name, including her fiancé Machine Gun Kelly. However, many of the poems seem to have been inspired by the singer and his turbulent romance with the Jennifer's Body star. In the collection, Megan makes multiple references to her true love, Twin Flame, someone she also describes as a 32-year-old narcissist and a complacent rock star. She accuses the unnamed man of lying about having good intentions. Please share my video, thank you. You are an addiction that no amount of prayers will ever cure. Megan wrote in her poem titled A Beautiful Boy is a Deadly Drug. The title seems to be a reference to the caption Megan used on Instagram to declare her love for MGK in 2020. At the time, she said, Atchingly beautiful boy. Megan has had a number of highly publicized romances. She is currently engaged to Machine Gun Kelly and was previously married to Brian Austin Green. The actress dated her high school sweetheart Ben Leahy for three years before they split in 2003 and she briefly moved on with David Gallagher. She also dated Shia Lubu following their on-screen chemistry in the Transformers films. Megan has drawn on her past relationships as inspiration for her poems. In the foreword of her collection, she admits that one of said idiots finally broke me. It seems as though she is referencing her split from MGK. The pair sparked breakup rumors in February 2023 when she deleted all traces of him from her Instagram account. However, just days later, the pair reconciled and have been going strong ever since with the help of couples therapy. She added in her foreword, and from me poured these poems featuring previously unspoken feelings of isolation, torment, self-harm, desperation, longing, restlessness, rage, and general anguish. Becoming a sacrificial lamb. In Pretty Boys Are Poisonous, Megan reveals that her healers tell her that her throat chakra is blocked. She has been told she struggles to identify her feelings and articulate them to others. Please subscribe my channel, thank you. However, Megan said she disagrees with this. Instead, she said she deeply identifies with her emotions and has a multitude of ways in which she can express them. Sadly, she's found that doing so makes the men in her life feel intimidated, inadequate, and insecure. In the foreword of her book, Megan also admitted she has spent her life making herself small so that others can thrive. She added, I have always believed I am meant to be a sacrificial lamb, a ransom soul.